Yo guys, welcome back, and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to create this grunge CRT spotlight effect. Starting off, I'm going to go right here and just create our adjustment layer. We're going to go ahead and add motion tile, and the reason behind this is just so we can actually avoid our effects going on to these black borders in our video. So only our video in the middle is being affected, and our actual black borders are not being affected. So I turn off motion tile right here. You can obviously see that there's actual black borders in this video. So I'm going to go to our output width, put at 70. Close this out. I'm going to go ahead and add our next effect, which is going to be our four color gradient. Go to our color one, put it on black. And go to our color four and put it on black as well. Now for actually color two and three, you can go ahead and pick any color for this effect you want. Just go ahead and make sure it kind of complements your actual video. You can go ahead and mess around with it to any color you like. Just depends on how you mix it. So once after you pick the color you want, I'm gonna go ahead and just pick a nice cyan color for both of these right here. Maybe pick like a bit of a kind of a not sure what color this is. Kind of like a I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what this color is. <laughs> I'm gonna go to our play mode and I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the screen. And it's gonna give us a nice spotlight effect. You can see right here. Once after that, I'm going to turn off our co four color gradients. The next effect you want to add is signal. This is actually a paid plugin. I'll make sure to leak it inside the description for those who want to purchase it. I'll go right here to hue noise and chroma loss and turn both these babies down all the way to zero. Once after that, I'm going to go right here to lumen modulation. Then we're going to turn off tape errors. Close this out. Then we're going to go ahead and add a noise effect. Dragon noise right here. Then we're going to go ahead and add CC threshold right here. It's going to be under stylized drag in the threshold effect. And it's going to give us a nice crazy Grinch effect. We're actually going to mess around with it a bit more. We're going to increase our blend effect right here, probably up to around 40. So we get this ink bleed effect or kind of a Grinch halftone effect right here. Just go ahead and mess around with it to what you like. I think maybe around right here looks pretty nice. And if you want, you can go ahead and increase our threshold. Just mess around with it and see what you really like. I think here's pretty good. Then I'm gonna go ahead and add our final effect to help tie this in. It's gonna be glow. Go to stylize and drag and glow right here. And you go ahead, just wanna increase that radius. You might increase that threshold just a bit right here. If I want, I might just put this above our tile effect. Not our tile effect, put this above our four color gradient. For our next effect, we're going to go ahead and add a glow effect. Drag and glow right here. Then I'm going to bring up our glow. We'll just bring up our radius as well. Just bring down our radius a bit. I'm going to actually go to our fur color gradient. Then I'm going to use the same color right here. And uh, just mess around with our actual clip. Just tweak our settings and see what you like. So I think right here looks pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and save our project. And yeah, um, that is how you create this Grinch CRT spotlight effect for your next edit or music video. Hope you, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, I would love it if you were to subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Just go ahead and share the video. It helps support me, helps my channel reach other people who want to learn new effects. Keep on staying creative and keep working hard. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.